Manchester United stopped Jose Mourinho from selling Anthony Marshall because of what the board perceived to be Luis van Gaal's transfer mistakes. Marshall could easily have left Old Trafford in summer of 2018, with Mourinho making it clear to Ed Woodward that he wanted to offload the French international. However, Manchester United ultimately kept Marshall who has started the current season in fine form, recently finding the net against Partizan Belgrade and Norwich City. And Unibet claimed Marshall wasn't allowed to leave because the United hierarchy were mindful of Van Gogh's overseas approach to selling players. Danny Welbeck was controversially sold to Arsenal, so United could accommodate Radamel Falcao, who toiled during his spell at Old Trafford. Michael Keane was a promising defender, but Van Gogh didn't rate him and allow the defender to join Burnley. In Van Gogh's second summer, the Dutchman was even more cutthroat. Nani and Robin van Persie were both allowed to leave for Turkey with Fenerbahce, despite being important players under Sir Alex Ferguson. Popular right back Raphael and Flok to Lyon with Van Gaal choosing to sign Mathieu Dermian as his replacement. And Johnny Evans and Javier Hernandez, both key players under Ferguson, were also shown the door. United, it seems, were wary of letting another game in Marshall depart for Preston's new. And that's why they kept the forward, who is now primed to play an important role under Ole Gunnar Solskjaer this season. The French international scored his first Premier League goal since August in a 3-1 win over Norwich on Sunday. And Sol J was thrilled with his performance, saying after the game, it's fitter for us, his top striker, and to have him back fit, smiling, enjoy his football. That's big thing for us. Mm-hmm.